your eyes give you your most important sense, the power of sight. You can read books, play sports, watch TV, see your friends, or any of the many other things that sight allows you to do thanks to your eyes being healthy and strong. But not everyone's eyes can be healthy and strong on their own. Sometimes, people begin to get blurry vision, like this, for one reason or another. This makes it hard for them to do things that they like to do. For example, if you have trouble seeing faraway objects clearly, you might not be able to read what is written on a chalkboard or see objects or teammates on a sports field. This is called nearsightedness, meaning that you can only really see clearly when objects are near to you. But people can also have the opposite problem. If close-up objects are blurry and hard to see, you might not be able to read books, play some video games, or even see clearly the food on your plate at dinner. This is called farsightedness, meaning that you can only see clearly when objects are away from you. Nearsightedness and farsightedness are two of the most common vision problems you or your friends might experience. Fortunately, with eyeglasses or contact lenses, these can be easily fixed. It all starts with telling your parents, your teachers, your doctors, or anyone else who you trust that you're having difficulty seeing. It is very important for you to have your eyes examined by an eye doctor on a regular basis, especially if you're under 21. When you're younger, your eyes are still growing and therefore should be checked more often. A vision screening is pretty easy and actually kind of fun. All you gotta do is read a chart. Vision screenings can help you know when it's the right time to talk to an eye doctor. If something is wrong with your eyes, finding out early is always better because it can lead to better sight later on. Getting a simple checkup once a year can go a long way toward making sure that you have strong, healthy sight for your whole life. Another eye condition you might experience is called pink eye. Pink eye is an infection in the eye that causes redness and itching. If your eyes are ever red, itchy, or full of mucus, you should see the school nurse or talk to your parents about seeing an eye doctor. Pink eye can easily be taken care of by simple eye drop medication and you can avoid it by being very careful not to touch your eyes without washing your hands first. Make sure to talk to your parents, your school nurse, or your eye doctor if and when any of these things happen to you. Far away objects like the chalkboard are blurry. Close up objects like books you might be reading are blurry. Your eyes are red, itchy, or full of mucus. One eye sees things blurry and the other does not, or if your eyes are in pain. Remember, the only person who can see through your own eyes is you. If you're having trouble with your eyes, you should talk to your school nurse, your parents, your eye doctors, or your teachers to let them know. Thank you for watching Unite for Sight's Eye Health for Students informational video. For more information about vision problems in schools, please visit www.uniteforsight.org slash eyehealthstudents.